Hey gang, Mike Raver here, and I'm going to rave about a pretty kick-ass little tool I just discovered. It is a chat roll, basically, that you can put on your blog is what we're utilizing it for. You can also put it on a Facebook page. Uh, you can put it on several different things, but uh, I'll cover a little bit. What it does, basically, is you can see here I got my blog here, Secret Skype, Trapers, Secret Skype Scrapers Training, or because it's a secret. Uh, you can post this little picture here, which actually is off just an image that I made, as well as a video. We did a specific hangout. How to post that is a little different, but I'm going to show you how to do a video specifically. This is the chat roll, which you can see here. I named it Secret Skype Scraper Training, so that is the specific chat roll that it's called. And the cool part about it is that when I go to Marissa's post here, which she did a little chat test to see if it was working, and I type in here, and if you look, the last thing here is hola. But if I type in her blog roll, making a video on how to post this on your blog right now. You can see it puts in the chat roll that people can communicate. All kinds of people can uh, talk left and right in there. And it posts it on my blog. So it's the same chat roll on my blog that is on her blog. So it's multiple communication through everybody, and we're going to show you how to do that right now. Chat roll or chatroll.com. You can go in, you can obviously sign up for free, and once you do, dun, 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 let me close that so it won't be messed around. Once you, once you sign up for, uh, once you sign up, you can go create a new event. When you create that event, it'll be right here. So you can have different events for different chats. And from what I understand, all the various messages that are in here right now stay valid for about five days. Just a little FYI. Not that you can, it's an immediate uh, contact message. So it's a great way to, what we're going to use it for is actually having a hangout so that people who visit this page can chat in it. And you can sign in with Facebook. Twitter, your email, there's even a, a different methods of uh, signing in, which is very cool. So when you do get to the chat roll, you do want to, once you create an event, it's very, they got tutorials, video tutorials that you can go through, it'll show you exactly how to do this, it'll show you how to post it on a, a Facebook page, it'll show you how to put it on your blog, uh, but you click install module, and when you install the module, it comes to this page where you get all the dashboard, the analytic settings, but for the most part, generally, there's different options here like I said Facebook page Joomla I'm not familiar with a lot of these but blogger is a cool one so a lot of people use generally you just pretty much want to use the universal methods which would be the HTML which is what we're using and then that gets you a code so just to give you an idea of what I'm doing here I'm gonna show you uh, dun, dun. I'm gonna delete that I'm gonna delete that and I'm gonna delete that so I have this banner here that I took from another post but uh, pretty much how you get this here is the same way that you get anything anywhere and I'll show you that real quick it is let's see so first of all we do want to grab a video so if you have a video say on any if you don't know how to embed a video you pretty much come to any video on YouTube specifically the video not the link and then you hit share and then you hit embed and then because it is the Empower Network blog specifically I already know that's a 590 that you want to utilize I choose all turn all these off mostly so that when people watch the video at the end of it it doesn't give them somewhere else to go so it just they pretty much have to stay on your blog it's a little marketing method there so then you just want to come here and at the visual and text side is the HTML code this is how and if you look at the HTML code it's got a lot of code in here where do you stick it I don't know so here's a good way to use a placement which is I use XXX just on the visual side and then on the text side there it is right there so I double click on it and then I paste in the code that I got for the video and then ta -da, the video is there and that's exactly how it should show now for uh, an image if you want to stick an image here here's a quick little uh, grass look so for if you have an image which you can see I'm grabbing this one and instead of just I can do a couple different ways I can save the image as or I can copy the image but I like to do it a little bit of a cheating way where I just grab it scroll it up to that tab and then stick it where it goes see how that works and I can do some things with that a little bit later the next thing I want to do of course is put the chat roll in and again to use my placement I'm gonna put XXX and then I'm gonna go to the HTML 
there's my XXX. And on the set on the chat roll, when you're installing the app, you copy this iframe code, which it says right there. It gives you the steps. It's very cool. And then you just paste it in where you stuck that XXX. And the visual, there you go. And you got completely everything that's there. So I'm going to go ahead and update it. Dun, 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 dun wait for it to update it's done editing and here's a quick one if you hit view post particularly in this blog with the empower network blog anyway hit view post it's going to post it right in this screen so i like to right click open in new tab open in a new tab so it'll have it all individually separately and i can compare the two and then go back and edit as the as the case may be as it's loading up you can see it's got the banner as well there's the video there's the image there's the chat roll which is the one that the exact same one that uh, the event you can see that even though I deleted it it's still got the same comments that were in there because chat role which you can also monitor it here administrators moderators can actually monitor it here which is very cool and then you can change the settings and everything as you're going through the chat role so it's a great way for people that are visiting your blog to chat one-on-one -on -one right away using their Facebook, their Twitter, their email, whatever they want to use to log in. So I hope it explains exactly the exact how to make a real quick blog with this very cool tool. Uh, again, it is free. I think it has up to 10 people you can add, uh, 10 people that can utilize this at one time, and that's across all blogs all the places that you're posting this chat role. So it does cost to upgrade, but you can find out that for yourself. And if you have any questions, I would urge you to do one of two things. Comment on this blog, because the blog that this video is going on is going to be how to do this, not the blog itself. So put comments down below, which you do have to sign in with LiveFire, which is another free comment method that is very handy to get for several different reasons. But if you uh, log in with, oh, I forgot to show you one quick thing. Uh, if you notice right here, I don't have a profile. So when I click on my name, it actually goes to my profile in chat role. I go in my profile settings and I can, and these are my settings. There's my username that I can change. You can put a little about me so when people click on it, they know who you are. I would like to put a picture. Da, da, da. And I'm going to put this one right here. And then I'm going to upload it. So that's how you update your profile so people can identify you. And then you got to save the settings. And I'm just curious here. Thank you for bearing me with what we are. I'm going to go ahead and, ah, it does it automatically because chat role is separately hosted. I don't have to update this blog because it's separately hosted on chat role. So again, very cool tool. Hope that helps. After this, the only thing I need to stick in on my blog, of course, are things like my signature. And, dun, 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 whoops. Oh, I stuck it way up here. But if you want to know how to do this, that's a separate video. So Mike Raver, we're going to rave now about this Hangout that we're going to have where other people can chat and ask questions and find out more about RCC, which is taking Skype by storm, talking to hundreds and hundreds of people at the same time, speeding up your recruiting and informational processes. Again, rave now, and we'll chat soon.